we all know that uh, human breast milk is the best nutrition for infants. However, for those infants who cannot be breastfed, um, animal milk-based uh, formulas are mostly used. Increasing incidence of uh, protein allergy in infants is uh, resulting in a search for safe, palatable uh, and functional uh, plant alternatives. Um, in recent years, um, hydrolyzed rice uh, was shown as a, a good um, option for infant nutrition. Uh, however, uh, functional testing of uh, this protein was not done. Um, it's confirmed that uh, rice can be well tolerated by infants and can uh, supply um, sufficient nutrition for infant growth. So in our work, uh, we produced uh, two infant formula. Uh, one is standard uh, cow milk based and another one is uh, a hydrolyzed rice protein based where uh, hydrolyzed rice is the only uh, protein source. We confirmed that um, hydrolyzed rice uh, infant formula uh, had satisfactory nutritional profile and um, moreover it had a very high solubility even compared to standard uh, dairy formula. Uh, after that uh, we performed testing of digestibility and uh, functionality of uh, this formulation. So for digestibility studies uh, we performed simulated infant static digestion uh, where we um, modeled um, conditions of uh, infant digestive system uh, in, in the laboratory. Uh, we confirmed uh, that um, rice formula uh, had higher content of free amino acids before digestion compared to standard dairy formula. Uh, moreover, it had high degree of hydrolysis and uh, as well uh, higher abundance of uh, short um, peptides. This could be explained by hydrolyzed state of protein compared to milk formula where we had native protein. We performed functional testing of two formulations as well and for this we used a simulated intestinal barrier model which is a cell-based model. We applied a digested formula on top of cell monolayer and looked uh, at um, integrity of this monolayer after exposure. Uh, we confirmed that uh, rice uh, protein formula uh, had uh, higher integrity compared to control and as well to dairy formula and uh, this was due to uh, high expression of uh, tight junction proteins uh, such as uh, claudines and zonulin. Uh, these uh, proteins are known to build the connections between intestinal cells uh, and uh, their higher expression uh, can explain uh, this um, increase in integrity. Uh, for infants, uh, this uh, support of intestinal barrier function might mean that they will be less exposed to um, penetration of uh, harmful bacteria and as well allergens uh, through intestinal barrier, which can uh, support um, their immune system. The most important result of this study is that we confirmed that a rice hydrolyzed formula uh, can be not only providing uh, sufficient nutrition for growth and development of infants, but as well uh, support functional um, outcomes for infants. For infants who cannot be uh, breastfed and uh, cannot tolerate uh, dairy protein, there are only few options left for nutrition. Uh, thereby, it's very important that we continue uh, testing these options and ensuring that some functional outcomes can be um, achieved with um, plant-based formulations. In, in the future, we are planning to focus on uh, other uh, functional uh, testing for hydrolyzed rice uh, formula and uh, some of the outcomes can be uh, tested via clinical study.